Hey everybody, okay, so we're doing something really unusual today. We are at Target, one of our favorite stores, and we Yay. are going to do, <laughs> yay! <laughs> Perfect timing. Yeah, and we're gonna do a make your own fishing lure challenge. So uh, stay with us. We're gonna use some really unconventional things that are not fishing lures. So we are back from the store. We got a bunch of Halloween related stuff. We are gonna do a craft closet lure making challenge today with a bunch of really cool stuff that we got at Target. All of it was like a dollar, two dollars, three dollars. Pretty um, cheap. So yeah, so really inexpensive stuff. We just spent a couple dollars and we're gonna try and make fishing lures with Halloween stuff from Target's Halloween section. Here is our big haul from the Target uh, Halloween section. These are some weird wall clingy climbers, um, wall crawlers. We kind of thought that maybe these could be adapted into fishing lures. So that's that's one item. We've got spiders. We've got creepy fingers. We've got mustaches. My idea. Googly eyes. Yep, the mustaches were somebody's idea. Maybe. <laughs> they look like little black minnows, like infected black minnows. So we've got pom poms. Some twine and glitter. And we got this. Uh, oh, we got sticky, sticky hands. Spiders. These are plastic, so they float. I think you should very carefully snip off the rings of the ring okay. itself. Okay, here's some scissors. Okay. And you want to do one too? Sure. Oh. All right, well, so you can pick your color. So, what I'm going to do is put some super glue on the spider. I'm gonna take an extra wide gap hook and kind of hook it onto the spider like that. And let's see if this works. The super glue did not really work um, because the spider doesn't have a lot of surface area. So what we're gonna do is actually hot glue because the hot glue will take up some of that surface area and fill in those gaps. Well, I'm just really, really globbing this on there. So it's kind of making like a bug's body. Maybe we'll throw some glitter in here too. Okay. That is a crazy looking lure. I don't know if it's gonna stick because the glue's not wet. Ah! Dun, dun, dun! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're having fun with this thing. Oh god. There's a sticky, oh my gosh. Like, oh, 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 oh I got it on the same one too. I kind of feel like just rigging oh, this oh. like a, Bust. like a worm, and then, and then working it like a jig would work. I mean, it has a pretty good chance of working. Like, I think the spiders the are going to get the... The spiders? The hands? I'm just going to put on the palm of the hand. Spiders, hands, and fingers are probably going to do pretty well. I so you want to put this, okay, and where that. does your hook go? The hook, it would be like on one of the fingers. Will you want to do the super glue? Yes. All right, don't super glue your hands together. Now you have the pom-pom on the squishy hand. Mm -hmm. Now where do you think a fish would bite that? I feel like these would sink partially, so I feel like a fish would go under. Like this is the hand, and then the fish would be like, oh, good food. So I feel like I would put it on the underside. So you'd have the hook point sticking up like behind the pom-pom? Yeah. All right. So I'm going to actually bring the hook point in behind. Uh -huh. Hopefully this won't tear out when we try to use it. Oh, yeah. And then I'll put the hook here. So it's kind of, the point is buried into the um, pom-pom. So a fish would bite the pom-pom? They might. I have no idea, dude. I don't know what this is supposed to look like. Neither do I. I mean, it's just and then I'm just gonna poke, art. yeah. And then I'm just gonna poke the other end of the hook, mm. maybe through here. Jangly snake looking thing. Yeah, I mean, it kind of looks like a worm. I 
I scratch you. <laughs> All right, so these are weird fake fingers, and I have this feeling that we could actually make a lure out of this. So I'm gonna try some stuff. I still think the spiders will work. They might. Here's the creepy finger. Okay, so what I'm gonna actually be doing here is taking the creepy finger, and the hook is gonna be buried in the creepy finger, like that, basically. Um, and then I'm gonna stuff the creepy finger with shiny stuff so that it looks like some sort of bait fish swimming. So now I've got that hook just kind of poked through the silicone. And um, it looks like I might actually have to cut a slit here for the shank of the hook to sit in like that. So now we have pom-poms. Pom-pom. Stick them in there. I'm going to shove these down with a glue stick because <laughs> that's what I have handy. Do you want to <laughs> add glitter so it'll be shiny? Well, actually, we can add glitter or we can add foil. Hmm. Okay, so that's what that looks like from the bottom. Maybe we need some extra color in there. Can you grab me either a green or orange pom-pom? Um, We've got bluegills in our ponds. So sometimes they have, the, the red-breasted sunfish have orange on their bellies. Maybe you tie the foil with your twine. Mmm, that would be a bad idea. Because any kind of flash that you can get is a good thing. Tie that like that. So it does sort of double duty. It's holding the hook on a little better, and it's holding that foil on there. And it looks pretty, sort of. And these little uh, twine pieces that are hanging off, they might actually add some action in the water. Yeah. You know? That's a pretty cool Halloween lore. Halloween. Spooky. I'm scared already. Okay, so these are our Halloween inspired handmade lures. Um, there is a lot of glitter going around here and a lot of hot glue, but uh, we are going to take these to the park and see what happens. Okay, so we are here at the park. It is afternoon. We are going to try to get a little bit of fishing in before it rains. It's looking a little cloudy, yeah. but we've got some crazy Halloween lures. Are you guys excited? Yes. yes. The finger shall stroke the fish. <laughs> That thing's pretty creepy. <laughs> what have you got? Oh, I've got the, the green oh. spider. Also pretty creepy. Oh my god, I... That was a... That was a bite. Okay. Look, I saw this big fish come down. Like, maybe three pounds. That's like pretty big fish. It looked like it wanted something to eat. Oh, that's a fish! There's a fish! Yeah, one. Because these are actually working really well. Oh, there's like a little perch or something. I can see it. I see where he's going. He's like another touch of me. There are catfish in here. I know. A bunch of them too. I yeah. Three lined up. They're ready to be caught. I think they think it's too good. There to they be. are, and there's fish right there. I seriously think they think it's too too good to be true. Something's up. <laughs> oh, I just got a little bite. You got to set that hook if they bite it. So, the birds are coming, so. This is moment of sauce. <laughs> What's foul hooking? When they're hooked like in the side or... Oh, okay. No. Okay. <laughs> well, it's not a shock that these oh Halloween God. lures aren't a guarantee of anything. <laughs> Uh. No way. <laughs> I swear, I might have gotten a bite as I was pulling up. You might have. I... That happens sometimes. I'm gonna pull that right down there. Well, even if we don't catch a fish, this is a lot of fun to make these crazy lures. Mm. Imagine if somebody was... Um, Offering you like some weird thing that you'd never seen before and it smelled funny to you and it looked funny. Try it. Well, don't waste it. There 
are some hungry fish out there. <laughs> okay. Oh, the fish not have to I'm using the end of the of the sticky hand to hold. Oh, that's a pretty good idea. Very crazy lore. What does the hand? Sticky hand with a. Hey, do pole. we have any footage here? Have any intro? We're recording right now. Ah, oh, hello. Does it look like an octopus? Does it? I love their octopus. Pretty sure there's not an octopus in this pond. I know, but what if, go, what if it is? <laughs> Scary. Maybe <laughs> the fish know it's Halloween. Okay, so we did not catch any fish with our uh, Halloween lures. Boy, right at the end, I almost caught a fish. I, got, I definitely had like a <clears throat> bite. Yeah, we did have bites on these stupid things, actually, yeah. surprisingly. <laughs> um, we just didn't, didn't manage to catch any. I think the hooks that we used were too big. There were mostly bluegills over here, but we had a great time making them. That was it's really fun. It. it was worth it. And uh, we gone. Yeah, hot glue gun. We have all have glue all over our thumbs and fingers. Um, I have like a little, I'd rather have more little fun with the family than get a fish. Oh. Right at the end. Me too. Yeah. Uh, right which the is end. a good thing because we didn't get any fish. No. Um, but <laughs> starting to rain here, so I'm we're going to clear out um, and we're going to head home. But uh, this is a lot of fun and um, I don't think we're quitting our day jobs to make fishing lures no. anytime soon. <laughs> but we had a lot of fun. Hope you had yeah. fun watching. Well, happy Halloween, everybody. Happy, happy Halloween. Halloween. Boo. Boo. I'm scary. <laughs>